Did you know that there are secret builds on the gallery? Oh yeah, if you go over here, click hashtag and type in FGG secrets. I know how to type. I mean, secret. You get a whole lot of secret builds. Now a secret build is a build with secrets in it and you have to go in and investigate what those secrets are. And today I'm gonna go through a couple of these. The first build we're gonna be looking at is Granny's Pink Cat Hotel by Andrea to to and Andrea to Sarah. I did that right. Welcome to Granny's Pink Cat Hotel where you can stay with your family and these adorable cats. Granny loves her cats so much at the point where she makes her own food with the best meat for them. Oh no. No, 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 no. I wonder what type of meat it is. No, don't, don't encourage this. I don't think this is a very normal cat hotel. Um, I don't want to go in, but I, I already started and I don't have any self-control. So we're just going to plop this down. Not even 20 seconds into this video when we have questionable meat. This is the cat hotel. Which way is the front? This way is the front. Thank you, Newcrest, for, you know, sizing your lots in a, in a proper way. Where's that mailbox from? I didn't know we have that mailbox. Anyway, this is a very cute cat hotel. You've already got some accessible parking. You've got some cat signs. You know exactly what's going on. Ignore the pizza me over there. I don't want to go in. I don't know why I have vibes that tell me don't go in here, but I also have no self-control. So I'm going to ignore all of my instincts that tell me not to go in here and just look at the pretty colors and hope we have some cute cats in here. So this is the front room. You've got reception. A, oh my god, a cat calendar. The theme is apparent. I wonder what type of animals are here. Oh, more is that is that Granny? Is that Granny in her younger days? Oh, I hope Granny hasn't gone senile. We've got some hair already here. This is very accurate. As a cat owner, I just hit my head on that. As a cat owner, I know how much hair is everywhere. Okay, and we've got these little hallways in here. I don't know if I'm supposed to be here right now. Okay, this, this is where Granny lives. Or maybe this is just one of the rooms. No, this is one of the rooms. I forget it's a hotel. Got myself turned around. Anyway, we've got a nice little television. All the cats can come in here. You got the remote and a gift. Oh, she left you a gift. How nice. And then we go. This is a very cute bathroom. Okay, this room so far is very safe. No questionable meat in here. Let's go into the next one over here. Another room. Okay, these are all nice. These are very quaint. I don't know. I just, it something, the vibes feel wrong. Okay, I feel bad vibes in here. Okay, same bathroom. Okay, so this, this room so far does not seem all that dangerous to me. And then we'll go through these double doors over here. Hello. Are these, these rooms are probably all gonna be the same. Yeah, okay. All right, Um, right, I'm still looking for secrets. We got the remote in here. That's nice. And a, a pencil. I'm trying to look in, you know, places where secrets may be found. So you come up the stairs and it's very, very, um, this is just the landing. Ooh, okay. So this is a bigger room. Wow. Okay. This is fun for the whole family. Bring your kids here. I don't know if I like that idea. This is a nice bath. There's a toothbrush in here. Oh my God. Somebody left their toothbrush. I don't think that's supposed to be doing that, but that's fine. Okay. So we've explored pretty much every room in this place and I have not found a secret unless I'm missing something. Wait, there's a there's a freaking shed in the back. Oh my god, I did not I did not uh, notice. I don't know if I want to go in here. I'm sure it's just cleaning supplies, right? That's all it's gonna be. Okay. Um. <laughs> very scary storage spot. Okay, we've got cracks on the wall. Uh, this isn't so bad. I don't see anything that is immediately red flags. Like it's just a storage area. There can't possibly be anything. Yeah, okay. I don't... Oh, no. There's a door back there. There's a door right behind that shelf. It is a very well-hidden secret. I almost fucking missed that. Okay, down the stairs we go. Uh, this looks very stair... Oh, what? This is a maze. This is a maze. Why the fuck does Granny have a maze in the in the middle of a fucking cat hotel? Okay, here's a trick with mazes, guys. You'll get through a maze every time. Just stick to one side. So I'm sticking to the right side. I learned this from Percy Jackson and the Labyrinth or whatever the hell it was. Annabelle just stuck to one side and she always got to where she needed to go. So this was a fucking dead end anyway. Oh my god, is this entire video just me navigating through a maze? It feels like a horror game. Like, I'm actively expecting something to come running down the halls chasing me, possibly grandma. This is gonna take forever, and I'm, I'm dedicated to it now. This video is just gonna be 20 minutes of me going through this goddamn maze. <sighs> oh, I see an unpainted wall here. There's a flaw in this build. Granny, your electricity bill, grandma, must be huge. <laughs> so 
apparently there isn't actually a door to get into the secret room. So this was all for nothing. It was a ruse. I spent a lot of time just navigating nothingness only to find out there isn't a door into this room. And I think that was a troll and I think it's purposeful. So we're just gonna go in now. Um, This is the secret room under Granny's place. There is literally a heart and a knife in there. You guys really like secret basements with weapons and things and oh my gosh why so she's testing on people that's how she makes the food she chops people up she turns them into cat food and also they poo in here she keeps some of them in here to poo she treats the cats pretty nicely so i'm not really that mad at grim oh my god there's a fucking cat summoning circle and then that's all the cat food very nice storytelling um i don't appreciate the troll and also this this was scary um and i wouldn't stay here and thanks for your secret i wish you didn't tell me i want to get out of here the next build we're going to be looking at is the bay market by zoe leia the residents of newcrest welcome the market that had appeared overnight oh don't trust anything that appears overnight word of advice excited to start their own small businesses in the beautiful market surrounded by pools and glistening water. Just don't ever ask about the windows under the water or you will ever be so kindly asked to visit the toilet. Okay. Very nice management, it seems. And I hope this doesn't scare the shit out of me. Okay. That, I already am impressed that you built a goddamn bridge over this building. I don't know the, um, the reason why there's a bridge here, but it looks nice, so I think that's the reason. This is a beautiful market. Doesn't look like any Anything suspicious would possibly happen at all. Um, oh, you can see like the parking garage down there. That's nice. Also, don't judge the fact that I just fucking said garage, okay? I, it's been a very confusing year. Very beautiful. I'm gonna go in at a fucking snail's pace because this cam the game camera is just so slow. Okay, so we've got a nice little art store. I guess it's more of like a knick-knack knick area. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. This is nice. I love this. I love the idea of this. I wish The Sims had this. You know, like they did in Sims 2, but whatever. I'm not I'm not even gonna fucking talk about it. Hello, mailbox. Oh, he's here to have some lunch. Oh, it's so nice to see. I run into you everywhere, darling. Wow. Okay, a nice little cafe kitchen thing going on. Very, very cute. Okay, we'll, we'll keep going. Oh my god, I'm so ready to go shopping again. Okay, we have a nice little bakery. They uh, they sell cats here. Um, I'm vegetarian, I, so I'm sorry. It's, it's not really my thing. And over here, ooh. Ooh, this looks nice. Oh my god, this is beautiful. I am shop do not talk to me or my son ever again. Okay, some more seating areas down here. Very cute. Ooh, we got a little skiing shop. Look at these these themes. I love the themes going on. And then um balloon. Would you like many balloons? I sell many. They I'm sure the store is always sold out. Ooh, a magic show. Sh magic show. No, it's a fucking magic shop. All right, we got some uh, supernatural themes going on. More creative than the Sims team. Let's go. And some plants. Oh, this is lovely. Oh, there's nothing bad here. They did say if you misbehave, they, they make they make you take a poopy. And I don't want to know who's in the poopy room, but I guess I have to. Oh, no, no, no. This ain't bad. What is that? Oh, that's just part of the drapes. Okay. All right. There's nothing weird here. Never mind. I don't know why there's a hamper in here. I, I wouldn't do my washing here. <laughs> So, what I didn't notice, I had to take a second. Um, if you if you go into the bathroom and uh, somehow, I think there may have been a door missing or something, but if you just scooch over, there's a freaking ladder down here. Freaking bats. And I don't like the look of it already. Um, I don't think this is your generic office building, but we're gonna we're gonna investigate this. God, you guys fucking love basements. Okay, so this is just a business area. That's fine. Look, it's just an office building with a giant safe. Some very scary looking door. Um, we come in here and this is just an office meeting area. In fact, this is where they park their cars. So we're gonna, we're gonna zoom through here. We got some testing stuff. I'm sure this is FDA approved. I don't want to go through those doors yet. We have a nice little breaking, break area. Lots of chairs. Um, very weird chair, that one. I don't know what they're all looking at. What are you, what are you looking at, guys? Oh, 
Oh! No! No, 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 no. I am lost there, mirror. Ah. What the fuck is this? That's, that's not family friendly. That's not nice. Okay, we're gonna... <laughs> Why is that in here? Why is that in here? Why are they testing things and also that in there? And then three... Okay, more cloning things. Nice. Very... I appreciate all the work that you do for us. However, I don't appreciate this. Okay, okay. I'm just getting lost now because I am frantically trying to find a way out of here. Okay, so that's more testing things. Why? 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 And they can look into? I don't understand the point of this, guys. I thought this was a very nice place in Newcrest. What the fuck is this? They're, like, excavating into the ground to find, like, diamonds or something. I, this is unbelievable. How many enterprises? And who sanctioned this? And who let them build this? And how? Okay, humor me this. How did they build it overnight? You tell me. You tell me how they did this overnight. And then we have, okay, a bunch of pictures. Very nice. Good job. Oh, my God. That actually scared me. What the fuck is this? What the actual fuck? This, you've given me a jump scare. I don't appreciate this. What? What the fuck is this? Oh, very nice. Thank you. I, I appreciate- I don't want to know what's in these rooms. Hello? What is down there? Excuse me. There are schools down there. There are literally schools down there and also a skeleton. Well, thank you for making this. I, I fucking hate it. Did I miss it? Oh, no. I missed an entire fucking room. I missed- they're, they're, they, they're chopping up babies, first of all. Let's just, uh, let's just start there, okay, on their list of bad deeds. You come in here and then they've just got hospital rooms and things that- It looks clean and nice, but honestly, they're chopping up babies in there. So I don't even want to fucking talk about it. Where is that big room? Oh, yeah. And then they're also cloning people and poop. Why? Why? Why would you do this? What is your reasoning behind this? Absolutely disgusting. Absolutely disgusting. Did I miss anything else? No, thank God. I want to get out of here. Thanks for traumatizing me. I very much appreciate it. Have an awful day. No, have a good day. You did a good job. However, I don't appreciate the jump scare. Next build we're going to be looking at is Just Some Normal Stores by Miss Valoran. Just three normal stores. A boutique, an electronic store, and a bookstore with each of their own apartment above. Seriously, there's nothing suspicious going on. On, don't go in the back. It's just storage. I swear no need to call the FBI and ignore the high electric bill I believe you except I fucking don't so we're gonna investigate this together here. We fucking go All right. Well Newcrest is getting a lot of new um, you know commercial venues lately And uh, I don't know why all of them have to be so goddamn suspicious What which one do I want? I'll, I'll go left to right So I'll start with this fashion boutique over here. I love I love this I love like there's just not enough builds like this in The Sims because The Sims doesn't really encourage this type of gameplay even though we had get to work and then they only gave us like two shops but whatever I'm not gonna fucking complain. Ooh, okay, okay. All right, I see I see what you're dealing right now. This is cute. This is this is so cute and you've got little changing rooms. Oh my god, you get the vibe. You know, I don't think that's supposed to be there, but you get the vibe and I'm I'm loving this Okay, so this is like um the the proper storage room and shit like that That's fine. And then we've got a bathroom with nothing suspicious So i'm fine with that and then uh, we'll go upstairs here first I'll i'll do it. Like I said, i'll go shop by shop. Where the fuck did I go? Okay, so this is upstairs of this boutique and they said there are apartments above. Oh my god God, this just they've got the aesthetic going on there like the boutique downstairs is pink So I'm gonna be pink. Fuck you. I want to match. Okay. I'm digging this. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah This is cute. This is very cute. Nothing sus. Um, I did notice there w was no bathtub or shower here So I assume this person just like tumbles in here. They're like, okay, I'm gonna shower now <laughs> Wonderful, okay, so that's this side of the shop done the next one I want to go to is this one. I think it's a furniture store I think I know I said I'd go left to right. However, I'm very sus of the electronics store So I'm gonna go through that one last so we're gonna go in here first. I think this is a bookstore Yeah, this is the goddamn bookstore. This is nice Like it's like one of those like ma and pa ones. How did you do that? That is real. Did you use like that tool mod? That's really nice nice holy goddamn this is so cute why is this so cute though okay i like this this is very 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 nice and then finally we've got 
the fucking electronic store. I'm very sus about electronic stores. I hate going to electronic stores, by the way. I just, they scare me. They've always got this, like, intimidating vibe like this. Like, ooh, technology. So scary. We got some Roombas ready to go. Oh my gosh, very nice. We're gonna go check storage now. And luckily, it's just storage. You got the drones, the cameras, everything that everybody didn't want. And then we can go upstairs to the flats. Okay, we've got a communal little laundry room area, some closets. So this is the apartment. I love like everything is just aesthetically same uh, the same as the shop, which is probably not very realistic But it's the sims. So honestly who gives a fuck? This is so cute This is not like the colors to make everything match. How do you do that? Oh and a nice bedroom. Look at that Are You guys seeing this look at that. What the fuck? The carpet is moving with me. What the fuck is going on? How is the carpet doing? I'm not going crazy, am I? That is flippin' weird! Okay, well, we found one secret. What the fuck was that? But anyway, that's a cute little apartment. However, I am very curious about what's through this door. So let's pretend I am a journalist and I found this secret code and I have no idea what's down here. And I go beep, boop, 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 And then I go in and it's just some graffiti. I guess it's time for us to go downstairs. Nice gas mask, bro. I, do I don't read Simlish. Okay, time for the fucking murder basement. Oh. I know what this is. This is so cool. This is watchdogs. This is just watchdogs. You got fucking dead sec chilling down here. They got their laptops. They're hacking. They're super illegal hackers trying to save the world. I am literally in the middle of my second playthrough of Watch Dogs Legion right now. I fucking love that game. It's one of my favorite games. And I, this is making me very happy because I don't really talk about Watch Dogs, but it's so goddamn cool. I fucking love And the TVs. Oh my God. And they're gay and lesbian and inclusive like we fucking love dead sick okay this is so nice and the little tires going oh my god and the pe paint and oh my god i was expecting something very naughty and i got something very nice this is happy oh my god and they got juice oh man i'd party down here the extent of my computer knowledge is the task manager so i don't think they'd let me into dead sick however i'd hang out here oh my god so cool oh i love this i love this and you and the crazy thing is like this you can just do this without mods the sims allows this much creativity but ea's builds are still fucking boring but you can do this oh okay i this is i, I like this build so much this is fucking awesome and the stairs are like brrr. oh my god thank you for this thank you i love this build this was such a good build and there's stuff in the back and doesn't even need to be but there is like fucking 10 out of fucking 10 dude love it last build i'm gonna be looking at is the unsuspicious plane crash by gun gunami 7 riri oh no how sad but oh well just a plane crash totally not a secret place for aliens to party oh no a lot of people died oh well what an inconvenience unsuspicious plane crash now there is something a little bit suspicious about this plane crash that i would like to raise um first of all i can't actually see the plane the plane's not here because i move objects on isn't working so let's just pretend that there's a plane right here my point that i'm trying to make is um the most suspicious thing about this plane crash is one of two things either the plane crashed nice tree by the way the plane crashed and someone built a fence around it or the plane crashed perfectly within this fence either situation is very suspicious but anyway we're just gonna go in now um no aliens allowed if you're an alien you can't come in here um so this is in the plane crash remember move objects isn't working for some goddamn reason so um we're just gonna pretend we're in the plane now so you come down these stairs and there's nothing oh god there's nothing to do except this fucking batu door and then you come in here and um there's still nothing there's nothing i think there were supposed to be stairs here but once again the game hates me and we we're just gonna pretend there are stairs there and you come down the imaginary stairs and there's a weird alien reception going on i don't uh, this is supposed to be um virgin airlines i this is not what i expected and then you come in here and then we've just got another door here so we've got security i assume very um very sterile and unsuspecting and then we have 
alien bathroom with bidet toilet because aliens, they like clean assholes. And this is the back of the reception. Oh my God, and we got makeup. Is this for the go-go girls? The, the sci-fi go-go girls? Very cute. I And they've got money. Lots of money and makeup. My two favorite things. My game is lagging. Hello? I think my game is crashing. My game has not crashed. It just, it panicked and I calmed it down. Um, And then here are the bathrooms and the showers and things. Okay, so we've got some good workplace vibes going on here. I'm sure all these girls are having a good time. And you come in here and this is just the closet. Okay, so you, you drop your closet over here. The aliens go... And then they, they put your closet in. I hope that wasn't racist. I don't speak Zamzorp. Oh, this is nice. Look at this. Boom, 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 boom. I like this. The next build competition that I announced is um Woohoo Clubs. And this person's already like ahead of the game. So I'm just gonna count this as an entry for both competitions. Congratulations. Wow, what's what's through here? Okay, so these are just the bathrooms. Very nice. Club bathrooms, like in theory, look really cool, but you know it's just gonna be covered in piss and vomit and all that stuff. Oh man, this place looks really sleek. I like it. The sci-fi vibes make for really good nightclubs. Uh, we got the drinks, bitches. This is so simple. Like, it's a very simple build to finish on. However, like, you don't see these vibes anywhere. Like, dude, half of, most people don't even think to build shit like this in The Sims, but then you guys are like, uh, let me just flex for a second. This was so cool. So simple. I'm kind of annoyed that the build was uh, basically shat on by the game for not including the plane or the stairs, but it was a very, very sleek build. Nice little mystery going on. No aliens allowed, but it's actually an alien venue. <laughs> They lied to us. Thank you to everybody who submitted your builds. I'm sorry if I didn't get to your build, but um, there were a lot of builds. I know it's only showing me a very small amount of builds, but trust me, there's a whole ass list and you can go through it if you type in FGG secret. Remember to watch my speed build that I posted yesterday to get the information on the newest build that is gonna be judged next week. So have a good day. Bye.